Hi guys, uh, today we're going to talk about how to install Anaconda on Windows or uh, Mac M1 or M2. So, the first thing uh, I will uh, I'll put this link below the videos. So let's talk about Anacondas. Anaconda is open source, which is a uh, software that contains Jupyter, uh, also Spider etc that there are used for uh, the data processing data analytics or heavy scientific computing anaconda for works for R programming or so also python programming and and then the spider sub application of anaconda it's uh, used for like python open cv or uh, for python will work in spider so this uh <clears throat> to begin work with anaconda one must get it and install first so uh, follow me uh, I'll show you how to install anacondas so once we go to anaconda.com we can able to see this uh, anaconda distributions based on your operating system so uh, just run right now uh, for Mac here so I'm gonna click it yeah said hello so uh, you just download it so yeah which is uh, especially uh, uh, for a data science this is really uh, cool stuff uh, so yeah also so easy step to install and then use it uh, by the way uh, like you don't have any like uh, spaces on your computer to install Anaconda uh, you can use Google call up I'll show you later uh, which is uh, you can run on any systems there also which is really good so uh, installing Anaconda just just um, introduction after you read like uh, pop up read me on the Mac users and the license agreement continue and then agree but then so also uh destination to select and install uh so install type and install so installation okay hello you have to so run the package and the script yeah so <clears throat> also if you don't have any uh enough space for anaconda you can you can use uh, google collab which is uh i'll show you uh after uh once we finish this uh here actually we can mm, it doesn't take long actually yep so Yes. Okay. Also, okay. Let's let's look at the book collab until finish this. Okay. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Here, Google collab here, and then go to uh. Google, uh, like, welcome to uh, collaboratory Google, uh, yeah, Google Collab. So, which is this is really cool stuff. You see, this uh, the recent files. What you have, uh, like, go to here or the file, uh, notebook, new notebook, and then just pop up. So, here automatically you can start your uh, you can start. Uh, your uh here let's say uh okay 64 that was four no gonna run it mm -hmm. see is like and then when you need like press the code and if you need the text like we're gonna do the like a text like uh here also the codes uh, okay there you go print
there you go easy so that that was easy so uh, also you can uh, you have sign on your google account you can have like free space so uh, which is really good uh, just like i said someone you don't you don't want to install uh, an account down their system okay let's go back to the video so we uh, uh okay here's uh, okay uh, uh let's yeah move to trash like can trash so we can start an account let's just type it anaconda navigator also uh yeah anaconda navigator okay okay this is okay the application on that one now it can't be opened okay okay probably uh i'll put on a trash this uh okay hold on i don't think so that's the problems but like yeah, I ran from uh, uh, before this on my uh, window machines. So let's see what's exactly the problems here. Application. Yeah, okay. Yep, okay. Okay, I'll send this one's on here. So there is no problem already installed it. So we'll see this like I'll talk about it. See the data spill uh, also okay uh if you version and I can dance okay okay remind me later. So <clears throat> oh we can launch here uh Jupyter Notebook, uh, QT Console, also IBM, uh, Watson Studio Cloud, and then uh, Deep Not Data Lower Spider. Also, uh, we have uh, Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, Oracle Data Science Services. Uh, we have uh, Gluviz, Orange 3, and then PyCharm Professionals, and then we have so many things. R Studio, that was awesome and cool, right? So, uh, who are interested to get uh, artificial intelligence or machine learning or data science fields. But this is the uh, important thing to know. Uh, this is uh, really cool stuff. So we can launch uh, Jupyter Notebook and then here. So just give a second and then also pop up. So, yep. Yeah, so, uh, okay, let's see here. Now, when when start Jupiter's, like I see the doc, the disk tab and then document also download all kind of things of the another picture in Republic. So <clears throat> you can create also uh, a new file, Python 3 here. So, just like i said now here uh you have a jupiter also you can uh you can start uh working on it wherever your project have or let's see let's see like uh for example hello uh <clears throat> okay hello text okay equal to let's write little the script here hello so Okay, so, <clears throat> so name equal to input. Uh, yep, input like enter name. So a question mark. We can put nothing like that here. I hear you. So, uh, or no, like this. 
Okay, we don't. So, so message equal to um, yeah, hello um, text plus we're gonna concatenate here and the name so okay so let's see print message yeah message uh, that's crazy. <laughs> uh, okay so uh so when you run just click run enter the name it's like uh, my name is mafi i'm gonna put mafi so hello mafi uh hello mafi like uh we can put uh, the space on it anyways i'm trying to show you how they work so uh, once you finish uh, uh yeah simply uh click to close it and then also uh, here the terminal you can uh, uh, yeah they will can terminate it easily so uh, also next time uh, i think uh, uh we can do on the command line just to start up uh, all systems we are here so yeah this is a cool stuff this is an aqua navigator so uh just install it and then uh, mess around do what you like do what you want to do so this is really cool stuff thanks for watching me uh bye bye